I'm Jessie Draper, the Valley Girl. Valley Girl. What does your company do? Have you ever Googled yourself? Totally. What makes a great entrepreneur? What's your next big idea? Tweeting's like my favorite. Let's talk business. I'm like the Valley Girl. Hey. Yeah, I'm just waiting for Ted. You know, Ted. Ted Turner. I get to talk to him for five minutes, and five minutes only. What do you ask a guy who started CNN, owns more land in the United States than any other American, and created Captain Planet? What do you ask a guy like that for five minutes? I don't know. Let's talk business. Ted Turner is an American media mogul and philanthropist. He founded CNN and TBS, among other stations. He also helped launch the United Nations Foundation. Welcome, Ted. It's so nice to have you on The Valley Girl Show. I mean, can I call you Ted? Sure. <laughs> um, so, what are you doing here in Silicon Valley? We're uh, having our United Nations Foundation board meeting here. Wow, I love the United Nations. I heard you gave one billion dollars to the United Nations. Well, to the United Nations causes through the United Nations Foundation. One billion dollars. That's how the foundation kind of started, That's right? That's right. Well, high five for that. Well, thank you. Good job. That's amazing. So what kind of things is the foundation doing? Children's health has been probably our, our biggest emphasis, uh, but not just children's health. We, we've been uh, involved with the uh, campaign to eradicate polio, measles, and uh, and malaria. Wow. And, and we work in the peace and security area and uh, with disaster relief and all the other refugees to some degree. So you're pretty much saving the world. That's what we're trying to do, make, make life better for people. Wow, that's incredible. You have had so much influence on so many, in so many different areas of the world. In business, you started CNN. What are you the most passionate about? Making it a better world and to try and encourage my fellow human beings to uh, act like uh, educated, civilized, decent people and be kind to each other instead of bombing each other. I'm against bombing. I think it's time to I'm stop I'm definitely, bombing. I'm definitely <laughs> against bombing. We have enough trouble as it is with uh, earthquakes and a volcano erupting. I mean, we don't, we don't need to bomb, to bomb each other. We should stop doing that. Definitely. Now, you started that movement, right? Well, Fairly I, I, recently. I, I want to get rid of nuclear I mean, weapons, too. You've started the movement to get rid of them about 10 years ago, and 20, I think it was... 30 years ago. When I didn't start it, I just joined it. They're a long way still from getting rid of them, but, they, but, but at least we're, we've got momentum now, and uh, all these years we've been having an arms race. It looks like the old uh, films of World War One and World War Two. I mean, we've gone past that. That's, that's yeah. over with. We can talk to each other. We don't need yeah. to bomb each other. I understand you've been in two movies, two films. Why, well, just a cameo appearance. Cameo appearance. What did you do? I got shot in Gettysburg. OK. And uh, I sang a song with a chorus in uh, Gods and Generals. Do you like singing? I do. I love singing. You were the creator of Captain Planet, the environmental superhero, superhero show. And I watched that show. I loved that show so much. <laughs> um, I know the whole theme song. Captain Planet, he's, he's a hero. hero. Gonna, gonna take, take pollution down, down to zero. zero. The power is yours. Good job. <laughs> I loved that show, that was so fun. I've been involved in the environment since I was seven or eight years old. I love the natural world. I love butterflies and birds and flowers. And Me too. Just when I was a little kid. So I've always cared about it. What's your favorite animal? I don't really have a favorite, I love them all. I even love rattlesnakes. You love rattlesnakes? Absolutely. Ah! We protect them on my property. <laughs> Really? Yeah, because they have to have a place to live. Yeah, it's true. If they're here because God wanted them to be here, they wouldn't be here. How do you feel about cows? I don't particularly like cows. I mean, it, they're okay. Yeah. But I have bison. They're the uh, indigenous animal that lived on. How many bison do you have? 55,000. 55,000 bison? What do bison do? They eat grass just like cows, and you can eat them. They're, they're much better for you. They have half of fat and cholesterol that the beef does. Oh my gosh, where do you keep all these bison? Just um, like in your backyard? 15 ranches around the west. 15 ranches. Yeah. 
Wow. Uh, Nebraska, South Dakota, Montana, New Mexico. Yeah. Oklahoma, Kansas. I'm like the Valley Girl. I'm like Ted Turner. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. And now it's time for your dits moment. Do you mind if I call you Ted? No, go ahead. Well, Ted. Are we starting now? We're starting. Okay, Are you ready to start? start? Yeah, let's yeah, start yeah, over. Let's we'll start over. When, when, yeah, let's okay. start over.